Hi everybody, this is a video of the Philips 9 watt fluorescent GLS light bulb. As you can see, this is the fluorescent GLS light bulb I got from eBay. And as you can see on it, it says Philips Ecotone Energy Saver, lasts up to 5 years, and it's got 9 watts, which that's equivalent to 40. And on the bottom it says ambience. I don't know what the word ambience means, but it's got this man stroking the woman's head on it. it looks like they're having a relationship with each other. And she's laying down on the sofa, it looks like they're nice and chatting. So as you can see, you can see this beautiful GLS light bulb in this carton through the hole. But with it being a fluorescent one, it's got it's got it showing under underneath its carton, and it lasts up to five years. But it depends how often you use it. And I've tested this bulb before, and it, and it works perfectly well. It's got an electronic startup, and it's got that beautiful uh, twinkling star in that that hand. I don't know whose hand it is, but never mind. Let's turn it round to the back, so as you can see. Anyway, so as you can see, um, it says Philips Ecotone Ambience, and uh, these two pictures with uh, the four people. Looks like they're all having a, a talk with each other. Looks like they're all smiling. And how funny is that? It's got all the picture people's in people in each picture. It's got four of them. Looks like they're having a conversation, smiling. And on this bottom here, it's got a man and a woman facing opposite each other. Uh, the woman's not showing her face, but as you can see, a picture of these two lamps fitted with one of these bulbs, like this one I've got in my hand. Yeah. So and it says Philips Ecotone Ambience. And as you can see, um, it says. A light that creates atmosphere from a bulb that helps you save money. Ecotone Ambience is designed to bring an extra touch of quality to the way you light your home uh, while saving money and energy. That's what it does. So it's a soft slash natural light, uses five times less electricity, lasts an average up to five years. Depends how often you use it. Suppose it would last as long as five years, but it depends how often this this bulb is on for. So, what's it say on these little tips? Um, it says uh, ambient suitable for all living, dining, and bedroom areas. That's what it says on it. Sorry, the the the, the letters are all a bit missed out. So, um, economic uh, tour. I'm not sure what it says, but never mind. I won't read all that because they're, they're a bit squidged out. But let's look at on the on the other side. It says. Not suitable for electronic switches, photocells, time devices, and dust to dawn sensors. Uh, light output measured according to IEC 969 standards compared to a 1000 hour soft color bulb of similar light output. Lifetime base upon an average of 3 hours per day burning time, specially designed for domestic use. And, um, and it's on energy B, and that's what it says on it. Yeah, and it says recyclable carton, recyclable carton. That's what it says on it. So, anyway, I've read all these little tapes, and as you can see, it's got this little tape on it because it was a bit ripped. So, anyway, guys, I'm going to get it out of its box, and you'll see in one second or two, guys. So, I just have to just spare me whilst I know it's going to rip the whole lot of this off. So, anyway, let's go to the other side, shall we? I know I've, I'll take this bit up because it was... It was um because the bit was a uh, bit off. I don't know how that happened, but it came when I, it was like that since I got this bulb. So anyway, let's take this up and get it out. Oh, it's coming out now. Put the carton on the breakfast tea table and the, this piece of cardboard as well. So anyway, here I have the the Philips fluorescent GLS light bulb, and as you can see, it says Philips on it. It's quite similar to LED. LED bulbs are made like this, and it's got this. Beautiful built-on Edison screw cap with the um, stainless steel ring on it. And uh, what does it say on it? It says Ecotor 9 watt ambience, 230 240 volts, 50 slash 50 hertz, 60 hertz. To say it once again, it says 50 slash 60 hertz. Made in Poland. What's it say? That little piece on it. Is it? I don't know what that. If that's a letter or not. It's a C E. But never mind. It's made by Philips. So anyway, I'm going to get it to socket now. So. There we go, it's fitted in nice and tightly now. It's fitted in like so. So anyway guys, um, all I'm going to do now, just put it there a little bit. So anyway, I'm going to turn off this uh, big lamp now. So, right, that's it now. The big lamp's gone out now, everybody. So onto the Philips 9 watt fluorescent bulb and everything, everybody. Ready? Here we go. Wow, as you can see, it has a. It does come out very dark at first, but it will start to get brighter. But it will 
warm up to 9 watts but it only burns 9 degrees of heat which that's not really hot at all because it's an energy saving bulb I bet these bulbs are made to last I thought about getting one of those bulbs I used to go around every shop every electrical shop for a bulb like this but unfortunately they were very short of them they didn't have any in stock so anyway this one has come from eBay so as you can see and um, and, it's a, and it has an electronic startup and when you turn it on a bit of the orange lit up before the whole lot came in so as you can see now it's brightening up now it will burn up to 40 watts of light but not 40 watts of heat only burns it will go as bright as a uh, 40 watts and nine degrees warm it's only going to burn nine degrees once it fully warms up it does it does take a little bit of a while a little piece of while to warm up and everything guys so i won't worry too much about that so um so as you can see now it's uh looks like it's getting brighter when i first come across one of these bulbs when i was a little boy i thought there might i thought one if they have a, one of those bulbs had a magnetic startup like one of those heavy cfls do but don't look like it did when i first bought, bought one of those for my mom and dad's uh, outdoor light years ago that had electronic startup like this one does and now sainsbury's like i said about sainsbury's sainsbury's used to sell those bulbs um and safeway did and i, and I know tj hughes used to sell one of those bulbs like this and it, and it has a 827 kelvin i hope i'll come across a daylight one in, in this gls glow but it's a very nice sweet looking light bulb yeah let's take a good look into it shall we guys it's a bit like it looks a little bit like venus when you look at it that way but anyway let's hope it hold it this way so you can see can you see you know, you can't really see the tubes because it's it's frosted because it's globed over and it's frosted <laughs> so so anyway and that's a piece of its cardboard to hold this bulb in place and, it, and it's got this little hole so the very so the very top of the head of this bulb can poke through and um it's a very very nice carton it's so beautiful with this uh, gls hole shape so you can see the bulb and the, the way to get to the bulb itself you have to rip this this top was ripped off anyway when i got this uh when i got this off uh, ebay when it arrived at my flat it came i, I bought three of them but they'll be next uh, maybe tomorrow night so um only got uh, the 40 watt 60 watt and 75 watt and that's all it is so i love this color of this uh this uh, carton it's green I wonder what the name ecotone has got to do with Philips. Does anybody know, guys? Well, oh, I just don't know. Don't, well, anyway. <clears throat> so, so I had to put some tape on it just to hold it in place. And uh, every carton that says Philips will have this piece of hat, this piece of hand with a twinkling star on it. And um, and that's what it is. It's very nice though with people showing on this. And I used to look at these, and, th and this must be made from the very late nineties. As we were coming into where it was the well early north especially coming into the new millennium so anyway let's look all around my room and it shines nice and white yeah and um it does shine a very warm white when i look at it it's not really that bright it's only gives out a very soft glow because it's only got 800 827 kelvin and, it, and it, as it fully warms up it will warm up as a uh, nine degrees warm and 40 watts bright which it's doing now so let's take a look into it this way shall we it's like it's brand new I've, i don't think they ever made a uh, fluorescent bulbs of the gls glow with a the magnetic they always have with this uh with the uh, gls globe on it it always has uh, an electronic startup or even an instant startup but as you can see it's um but this one started up uh with electronically so and that's all it does so Anyway, guys, uh, as you can see now, the uh, the fluorescent GLS light bulb has uh, reached its full brightness at 40 watts bright and 9 watts warm and everything, everybody. So, all I'm going to do now is turn off this uh, light bulb now. So, right, that's it now. The big uh, the, the bulb's gone out now, so I'll turn this bright one back on now. Here we come. Right, that's it now, guys. Uh, the... Uh, the big lamp's back on now, everybody. So, anyway, guys, uh, this is a video of the Philips 9 watt fluorescent GLS light bulb and everything, everybody. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video. So, please comment, rate, share, and subscribe. Thank you for watching, everybody.